a couple of good things to keep in mind when you're working on your IDN. One, items on the side are usually draggable, like that. So you can just drag them in place. Places where you need to type will say, click to add text. Now, if you're like, I don't know, I can't read, this is too small, this is the key. View, zoom to at least 100. Okay, so now that is a lot more comfortable. So a plant consists of, I don't know, leaves, roots, and stems. And you can always go up and down. That zoom feature is going to be your friend. So again, it is view, zoom. Usually I would set it to 100 just so that you can actually go ahead and do your work easily. Your instructions for the most part will always be down here in the speaker notes. And for example, in this case, it says to color in the plant, click on each of the elements and choose a color. You literally just, for example, let's click on the roots. You click on them and you use the fill color to fill them in whatever color you want. Okay. I opened up a different one just to show you again. So I'm going to try to complete this second page. I can barely see this. So again, view, zoom to 100. Okay, and I can drag my pieces. I can color in my image. The instructions are right here on the bottom. Let's go to the next one. Instructions on the bottom. In this case, I'm actually going to add text to each of those boxes. I just need to click on them to start adding my text. And once again, I can select and color. When zoom to 100 is too close, I can always go to view, zoom, okay, in this case, Let's zoom to fit and I can see it again. I can drag and I can do whatever it tells me to do. Okay. And that is how you work in your digital notebooks.